We get it. We get it. You got an album, nigga. Damn. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Who the dick is? How are you going to put an album out? Yeah. 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 Honestly, I don't really like his voice that much. I don't know why he's singing like that. You know? <laughs> you know? But, 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 yeah, here, but at, the, it, at the same time, though, I don't care. What it do, Ken Folk? It's your man's Rod Carter. I'm so excited to be here. This is my second episode of The Spotlight with Rod Carter. I am your host, Rod Carter. Yeah, I know I said my name three times, but I don't know what the hell I'm doing, so fight me. Don't fight me. I don't know how to fight, but um, get mad and grit your teeth and puppy fist a little bit. You'll be all right. This is a show where I get to spotlight uh, CEOs of small corporations right in the Midwest, particularly black and brown, uh, who have decided to take their life into their own hands and not work for the man anymore. People who decided that they want to be their own bosses. I'm sitting here with a couple bosses today. A uh, good friend of mine, Frank Hubbard and Mr. Paul Law. How y'all doing, fellas? Hey, we chilling, uh, we chilling, bro. That's what's up, so, man. I appreciate uh, y'all for being on the show today. Honestly, we appreciate you, bro. You know, yeah, really, yeah. having us on. We really do. Right, man, look, look. We're worthy. <laughs> so tell the Midwest and hopefully the rest of the world what it is that y'all do. Uh, who want to start out? Go ahead, Frank. Uh, yeah, I start. Uh, save all the good stuff for later. Right. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm uh Frank Hubbard. I'm a musician first, mm-hmm. and producer, beat maker, and uh, got a new album out. Part with Paul, Ellie like Dub Baby, and um, and it's just the beginning of other things to come musically. Okay, and you know. Uh, trying to figure out marketing things and right. you know all right. that kind of stuff, but we, we learn learn stuff every day. Right. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. yeah, so that's what we do. We love doing music, and we want to put out mu- good music, and that's what we're doing. That's what's up, man. That's, yeah, that's, that's good to hear. What about you, Paul? Tell us where you from. You know, yeah. uh, my name is Paul Law. Uh, L.A. Dub, baby. Uh, anyway. <laughs> right. 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 <laughs> right. Nah, uh, but I'm from Kansas City, Missouri. I'm a I would consider myself a writer, producer, singer. Um, I, I sing, but I'm, I'm, being an artist is not necessarily my first love, but I do love expressing myself musically. Gotcha. Um, but yeah, writer, singer, producer, been doing it for a long time. And um, just trying to, uh, trying to create our own wave of music, which is why our record company our production company is called we the wave we the wave yeah, y'all we get the that wave. we the wave mm-hmm. we the wave music yeah we the wave music we are vibe and energy is what yeah. wave stands for got you acronym yes sir okay that's yes, what's up man that's, yeah, that's... which is you can follow us on instagram too okay we the wave music we the wave music yeah. at instagram right yep y'all got a facebook too no? no we don't have facebook yet i mean it's easy to do but we haven't set up the facebook yeah. Just understandable yeah. steps yep so yeah. frank um Let's start with you, man. I mean, you said it started with music. What, what, do, you, what do you play? Yeah, I started on drums, you know, okay. since I can, you know, start, since I can walk, I guess, start right. drums. I thought I was going to be a drummer, mm-hmm. you know, until I was about 19. Mm-hmm. And then I got interested in keys. And right. and it's all of a sudden one day I could hear, you know, sit at a musical at church and I could hear, uh, the organ player, the keyboard players playing chords, and I could hear the chords. Right. I just, I just know how to get them from what I heard to hear. Right, 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 and, right, right, right. You know, this little frustration <laughs> kick in, but I could hear it, and I was like, okay, I want to learn how to play key. You know, that's what's up. Yeah, that's what's right. up, bro. Right, uh, <clears throat> do you play uh, music? No, I, I do. I play enough to produce. I do no theory. Mm-hmm. Um, I produce some albums myself. That's what's up. But what's really great is I've always been with Frank when I produced them. Like, they, I've always. I can seriously think back to every project I've ever done in some way, some way, some way, form or fashion. Right. He was on either a lot of the songs or, you know, mo- you know, most of them all the time. Yeah. So we've been making music a really long time together. It's really dope. That's what's up, man. I, I noticed that y'all's uh, uh, off camera. I got a dope vibe, you know, so y'all yeah. 
kind of like brothers. Y'all, y'all been rocking together that long? That yeah, long. It is. We long, are. Man. Yeah, we definitely brothers. Yeah. That's what's up, man. That's good. That's good. And, and, and it's funny to me because, yo, I'll be singing something and he already knows what I'm about to do. Uh, and right. he'll be playing something and I already know what he's about to do. Like, we mm-hmm. really can legit figure out how a song is going to go when we're working together. That's it's really crazy. That's what's up, man. Yeah. That's what's up. So yeah, y'all both got families, married kids, all that. Oh yeah, that's what's up. Yeah. That's what, so how do you with that? Um, I know we the wave. Do, do you? Is that all you do, or do you do you still hold down current uh, other jobs, or is oh, yeah. we the wave your source of income, or you you double up? Yeah, technically we we started we the wave probably about a year ago. It was July. Probably, probably right before. Everything shut down, coronavirus, mm-hmm. all that. Mm-hmm. We was in the process of, we, we had already started working on EP, five okay. song EP. Okay. And and we said, okay, we got songs that we got. We want to upgrade sound. We want to upgrade. We want to do, just change the way we're doing it. Right. And so I said, well, hey, uh, fr- another friend of mine is Tyree Johnson. Mm-hmm. And uh, I, and we, I, already, I already been talking to him about, uh, con- collabing on music or something. I said, you know what, man? I said, let's hook up. I hooked up with him. Right. Went by. I was like, this dude knows what he's doing. Right. And, you know, the software he used. And I was like, I said, oh, okay. So I said, well, shoot, man. Hey, I'm working on the album with my friend Paul. Let me, once you come out, I introduce y'all. Right. And introduce him. And from day one, it, it kind of hit off. And he... That chemistry, he just started gelling. And he just fit right in with what we was doing. Right. He brought another element to mm-hmm. what we was doing. Mm-hmm. And and next thing you know, EP came out in May. Okay. February 12th, last month. Okay. And what's it, what's it called? The EP was called I'm Paul Law. I yeah. am Paul Law. And that was, and that was May of, 20, of 2020. Okay. Yeah. And like I said, we worked through the pandemic. Wow. You know, hella high water. We made sure we put that music out because... We just, we just couldn't let it allow. We couldn't allow allow anything to stop the momentum we were creating. Right. Mm-hmm. right. And then we moved from the EP. We were still learning about promotion, still learning about a lot of things. Right. And we moved right on into LA Dub Baby. Um, it was a crazy decision to change the. You know, our, LA Dub Baby is nothing but the Ampa La Deluxe, really. Got you. But changing the name was more. Every song I was saying, it's LA Dub, baby. Uh, you that's know, right. Every yeah, song. That's, that's your thing, so, right? So it was just, it was just turned yeah. out to be just a, a more marketable uh, way to go. Got you. And it's uh, kind of like a tag. It is right. a tag. It's a tag. definitely a tag. Yeah. Got you. Right, right. We all got to have one. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, business owners mm-hmm. and um, balancing family. Well, no, another part of this show is uh giving everyone else that experience because some people want to be business owners some people want to strike out on their own what before i get there before i get into the details of it right what got you frustrated enough or not even frustrated but what was it for you that said man i don't want to do this the rest of my life i want to do what i want to do the rest of my life do you do either y'all remember that moment being on whatever job and what job was it where you said you know what i can't do this no more. I got to do something else, even if it's you know one step at a time. Did either one of y'all want to share that moment? Yeah, for me, um, it was there was two events really. Mm-hmm. I've always known that I wanted to have my own business. You know, back in the day when I was trying to get a record deal, mm-hmm. you know, you know, and I was heavier too, so I was four hundred eighty eight pounds. Uh, didn't you know? I, but I but I still believed I was talented enough mm-hmm. to get a record deal, and the, the thing that happened was, man, you know, times changed, social media changed, everything changed, and I realized that I don't need to get a deal. All I need to do is, you know, my marketing strategy has, or the strategy I've developed for us has always been social media, right. growing our growing our our footprint into the universe mm-hmm. um, through social media, gotcha. and and where I'm going with it is is that. Once I realized that we could just control our own destiny by posting and 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 making genuine connections with people on social media, mm-hmm. um, that was the first time I believed it could be done. Gotcha. But I got sick in 2018. I had pneumonia and the flu wow. for the first time in my whole life, and I got hospitalized. Wow. And but before I did that, I had been doing some network marketing. Okay. So I'm up here making money for these people. Right. 
and I was posting all the time going live for them and their stuff. Right. And it was one more thing that didn't work. Mm -hmm. After me, I always trying, 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 and I never really give in to stuff like that. Right. But I said, I'm going to do it. I'm right. going, I'm jumped in. I was trying to get him in. I was trying to do everybody, you know? Right. right. And so I'm up here promoting these people, making them rich, and I never made really anything. Wow. And, and it hit me that I'm sick of making other people rich. Facts. That if I'm not obsessed enough to, that I don't give up on me. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? Right. I had to just, I decided that I was going to just, just bet on me. Bet on you. And yeah. when I say me, Frank know I mean him. Right. Frank, you know, Tyree should know I mean him. Right. I never think from the from the terms of me and then they sure, they sure, my sure. they my background right. or some shit. Right. This right. ain't this right. ain't that kind of group. Right. right. You know what I'm saying? Right. I wouldn't be anything without him. Right. I believe that. You know what I'm saying? That, that's why we're together. But what I'm saying is is that it got to that point where that sickness mm -hmm. made me feel and believe that if I left this earth no one would truly ever know who I was. Gotcha. And why does it matter? I don't know why the F it matters. Right. It matters to me that I've never been true to me. Gotcha. And I've always compromised everything I've ever done. I got tired of it. So I decided to just jump in and, 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 and do that thing. And, and that took the fear away because right. I was so disgusted with myself that I always make money for everybody else but I mm. never went a hundred miles per hour for me for yourself you know what I'm saying man that is powerful bro that's yeah. that's that's real powerful man yeah. I, I I appreciate you sharing that because that's the whole thing about uh being a business owner it's scary you know what I'm saying? It's, yeah. it's one of them things, sink or swim, yeah, you right. know, you fly or fall, you know, but at some point you got to get to the point that you make that jump. Yeah. yeah. Frank, what about you, man? What, what I mean, what, uh, what made you do it? Uh, honestly, I think, uh, you know what? I think I was so, I, I loved music so much mm -hmm. that um, it just like I'm always gonna do music no matter what. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Uh, uh, and you know if if no church wanna hire me, mm -hmm. I'll be at home playing keys. Right. I go over my boy's house. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Uh, just hey man, where's your keyboard at, man? You right. know what I'm saying? So I just feel like that's just something that I'm just always gonna do whether somebody hire me or not. And I think it's kind of similar to what he's saying that sometimes you sometimes we we think. And we care about what people think about us and we, we, what people say about us. We focus on that so much that you can't focus on just like, man, just focus on what you're doing. Right. And some people ain't going to like it. Some people will like it. Right. And right. if you don't worry about that and focus more on what you got to do, and then I think that kind of helps take away the fear and take away, I mean, a lot of heartache, a lot of, you know Worry. what I'm saying? Because you're so focused on what you're doing. Right, right. And just and like I said, just go for it, man. You yeah, ain't worried about too much for people to think. Yeah. That's and, and you know, because here's the thing, bro. People are going to judge us. Right. You know, I know singers who can sing me under anything. Right. They they are just, they, they can do any note. Mm. They are just the most amazing singers in the world. Mm. But at the same time, they still ain't making songs the way that we do. Right. They still don't write. Right. They still don't have any material. Mm -hmm. They're just working at the water department. Right. You know, they're just right. doing whatever they do. Right. And my point is though is that they're going to judge you. Mm -hmm. People, I I really feel judged. Mm -hmm. I really do. Like mm -hmm. I know that people. Hey, who, who, he posting again? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we get it. We get it. You got an album. <laughs> 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 You know yeah. what I'm saying? The keys. How you gonna, yeah. how you gonna put an album out? Yeah. 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 Honestly, I don't really like his voice that much. I don't know why he's singing like that. You know? <laughs> <laughs> you know? But 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 yeah, here, but at, the, it, at the same time though, I don't care. Like like I sad, care right. because I want and believe that my song could be next on the radio right now. Right. No right. matter who went before it. Mm -hmm. Tank, Ty Dollar Sign, right. Delicious Kisses. Right. It could come right on right in there. Right, right. No big deal. Right. 
And, and and I don't just believe it, I know it. And that's another thing about about failing with the music, bro. Mm -hmm. It's one thing to just love to play. Mm -hmm. Like he love I mean, he does, love to play. Right. But he's also amazing at it though. Yeah. yeah. So so you not only have to be good and love it mm -hmm. and have this desire and the passion. Right. You also gotta be talented and you gotta be honest with yourself. Because mm -hmm. if you suck, look. I'll never write a song that I can't sing. I'm never gonna write a song I can't sing, bro. Right. Yeah. I'm gonna right. take if I, I'm gonna mm -hmm. elevate that song. I'm gonna elevate it to the highest point that I can sing it. Mm -hmm. Right, right. But well, I'm gonna write. Why would I write a song right. I can't sing? Right. <laughs> you know what I mean? Right. So right. that's what I mean. People don't they they write these songs. Maybe they're good writers. Maybe they're not good writers. But mm -hmm. at the same time. They're not, you, you have to be honest with yourself because that's when you were, but no nobody support me. Mm. Don't nobody gotta support you. Right. Yeah. Don't don't support me. I don't know, I ain't gonna speak for Frank, but don't support me because you my boy, I went to high school with you. Mm. Support me because it's dope. You understand? That's 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 don't, do, don't do me no favor. Don't, don't, I'm just, don't, I just shared right. it for him, man. I just shared it for him. Right. Little, little, you know. Give you a pity like. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> pity like. Pity like. Pity like. Pity like. Pity like. Pity like. Sean. Sean, click the like button, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, no. Nah. No, nah, don't do that. <laughs> hey, hey, what you know what, though? <laughs> I take a pity like okay. because when somebody, <laughs> when somebody else look at your pity like, yeah, to them it's just a like. So they, 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 they don't know. They don't know it's for pity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah hey, but like, it, it do, that like set up that yeah, algorithm though, right, so you need right, to go ahead and hit that like. That's right. <laughs> hit the like, y'all see the hit the like. Yeah, all the likes are the same color, right, brothers. Like, all blue. <laughs> I'm gonna like it this time. I'm like, okay, well, yeah, yeah. whatever. Yeah. 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 Are y'all looking for writers? Are you looking for singers? Are you looking for more producers? Are you looking for just artists? Where, where do you see uh, moving forward immediately? Uh, right right off top. What are who are y'all looking to work with? Well, I'll speak first, but I, I know Frank, and we don't differ in opinion in this. Mm. We just, we, I know he'll say it different than me because okay. he's nicer than me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but, That's good. So, but here, here it is. We don't. We love collaborating. Mm -hmm. Yeah, collaborating with other producers, mm -hmm. collaborating to us. Even if we're writing for an artist, mm -hmm. it's a collaboration. Gotcha. We want to bring out the best in that artist. Um, I believe that, and and I, I remember telling them this in the studio, him mm -hmm. and Tyree. Mm -hmm. If we can make me sound amazing, mm -hmm. imagine what we will do for someone who does sing a lot better than me. And I know I'm kind of being hard on myself when I say that, mm -hmm. but I'm also being honest about my limitations That's as a singer. Right. I, yeah, I can sing, right. but but there are so many people that can sing better. So if they'll listen to me mm -hmm. and they'll take the direction from me and Frank and Tyree, mm -hmm. we can, that, that disconnect between them singing to the moon mm -hmm. and selling a million records mm -hmm. is just the collaboration between We The Wave and that artist. Gotcha. So so yeah, we we want more artists we want other producers and, and opportunities to collaborate with those producers you know what i mean okay um, so so your company um are you just a production company or are you a label looking to sign artists or or is this one of those things where artists wants to uh cut a record and then they come to y'all y'all do the record and then goodbye or is it you guys are actually signing artists right now to push their music what we have the ability to sign artists if we wanted to. Okay. Um, but we are a production company. Okay. So, so, but but here's the thing. Anytime there's a musical movement, mm -hmm. there has to be a relationship between a producer and the artist. Absolutely. So Snoop Dogg and Dr. Dre made it big because they were together. Right. Eminem and Dr. Dre. Every, every DJ Mustard and LMA, you right. know, they... There's a there's has to be that artist and that producer connection that makes that sound come out, you gotcha. know. Mm -hmm. And so so that's where we are. We are we're willing to have a relationship with an artist mm -hmm. and a relationship with other producers to to build something because see the thing that's missing in Kansas City is the fact that um there's too many people who think they're the chief. Right. And that you're the Indian, right. but why can't we all be chiefs? Right, right. And still have a smoke the peace pipe. You know what I'm saying? 
Because you a king, right. I'm a king, right. he a king. Right. You ain't littler than me. You a right. boss by yourself. Right. Yeah. And I'm, we just I'm, all I'm be I'm great together. Lower, man. You, you, well, kinda, but you, 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 kinda, you little, yeah, but you are still a boss. I appreciate <laughs> it. I'm, I'm working on it. Yeah. Yeah. Working on it. But, but that's what I'm saying. We can be kings together. Right. Um, I humble myself to Frank a lot, man. Everybody can tell I'm more charismatic. I am more in the front. Mm -hmm. And he and he doesn't mind being where he's at, right. but I but he, I won't let him. He can the, he gonna be in the video. He mad. He like no, I don't want to. We gonna just pay the camera pass, Frank. You know what I'm saying? Like <laughs> you gonna be in the video. Yeah. Like, so it's just it's just that thing where you got to be able to humble yourself to someone when they have control. When when we're in the studio and Frank say no, nah, I should be like this. Mm -hmm. Me and Tyree go okay, let's go. That's what's up, man. We got you. It ain't. It can't be that one person. No, nah, it's gonna be my way or the highway. Right. You, yeah. You that's do that. You 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 can't work with people successfully a, with that mindset. That's a dope yeah. partnership, man. Yeah. And uh, honestly, I, some some things I struck. I did struggle with, with some of that stuff uh, as we create too. Sometimes because mm -hmm. Tyreek go, "Hey, man, I'm gonna put this little thing thing in." And I'm like. Man, we gotta put that little thing thing in there for man. It's fine like how it is. Do that. You know what I'm saying? But, but I won't say it out loud. I'll just say, you know what? Okay, this that's my opinion. That's mm -hmm. what I thought about it. But okay, I'm a, I'm gonna trust what you're saying mm -hmm. and, and and back off and let it and let you do your thing. Right. Because the yeah. goal of us all is to be successful, and none of us is trying to dwarf or belittle mm -hmm. anyone's mm -hmm. motion. Right. So. I'm not going to run into the studio. I can produce, I can run Logic, mm -hmm. yeah. but Tyree runs Logic better. Okay. Yeah. So am I going to jump in front of him and tell him to get off the keyboard? Get, get off the keyboard, <laughs> bro. Yeah. Move. Yeah. Move. Right. Yeah. Right. I'm not going to tell him to move. Right. Frank plays keys better than me. Right. Can I pick through a beat? Yeah, I can. Right. But I ain't going to jump in front of Frank and tell him to do Hey, right. Frank, let me right. pad let this let one, bro. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's what's up, man. So yeah, the same thing we're writing, right? The same thing like, writing, yeah. No man, just change it. You need to change the whole line, man. Yeah, mm -hmm. you got too many words on that, that line. That, 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 I'm about to do that. that. Ty, <laughs> hold on, Tyree did that one time on a song, uh -huh. and he was really like adamant about me changing. I said, "Fine, I don't care. Let's do it." I mean, because he was so he, adamant he was about it. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. I said, "I don't care. I'll change it." It was on delicious kisses, yeah. and then all of a sudden he realized. I'll just leave it alone. Like, he, never, it. he never said it again after that day. For real. <laughs> It's like he was just trying yeah. to. I guess he, he wanted, wanted to see if right. yeah, he right. wanted to see yeah, if right. I was going to say something, and right. I was like, nah, yeah. whatever. That's yeah. some, sometimes we try things see if it work. We're like, yeah. Yeah, did you get work? Nah, nah work. It ain't delete. Right. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Undo, undo, undo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's what's up, man. So, please, uh, as we wrapping this up, please tell us. Uh, I know you just came out with a record. Yeah. Uh, what was that? Uh, February twelfth. February twelfth came mm -hmm. out with a record, and the name of that. It's L.A. Dub, baby. L.A. Dub, baby, and that's on... Uh, it's on Spotify, iTunes, Apple Music, you know, everywhere. All everywhere. digital platforms. All digital platforms. Yeah. Look it up. L.A. Dub, baby. Um, are there any other uh, artists or any other uh, records that y'all working on? We talking about the future now? So, uh, anything uh, that you've already started and you want us to look forward to? I say we, we are in a negotiation, I say. With a couple of artists that that I wanted to do some some okay uh, some a few of them local uh -huh. and uh, a few of them uh, we actually had abroad a abroad yeah. yeah okay yeah. just okay. say that yeah right. so we just see where it goes you know that's yeah. what's up that's what's up yeah, and so. um and then also at the same time we're promoting L A Dub baby um we're going to be putting out new music as we go you know yeah the E P wasn't enough. Mm -hmm. L.A. Dub Baby's not enough. Everybody keep... They want to... Can, can we do it again? Are, are we done? You know? Right. No, we're not. We have more music to come. That's you know? Saying. So we're going to always... We're always writing. We're always producing. Uh -huh. yeah. And we're going to keep putting out as much music as we can until people respect and appreciate the passion that we have in the universe for this music. I really appreciate y'all, man, for uh, letting me put the spotlight on you. Thank you, This bro. was a sure. very fun uh, interview. I look <laughs> forward to great things from We The Wave Music. If uh, if y'all looking for a production company to work on your music, work on your albums, please look these guys up. Uh, they shout it out. Uh, where, where you at on Instagram? We The Wave we music, music. We The Wave on, Music. On, there, on Instagram, I'm Paul Law. 
on Instagram. Frank Hub seven four. Frank Hub seven four on Instagram. And Tari the drummer, drummer. on Instagram. Uh, on Instagram yeah. the same. Y'all heard yeah. the links? Please hit them yeah. up. Um, Real quick. Yeah, We also absolutely. have merchandise. We do. That, okay. Uh, we have can go We have merch. We have a. Uh, we can put, we'll put the links with the video, but okay. yeah. um, we have a Teespring site. We also have some shirts that we are um, de- developing that will be up. out. There. Yeah. But they're, they're, they're already for sale. That's what's up. And, um, yeah. yeah, so so yeah. We're, 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 we're on it, guys. Businessman. That's what, that's what <laughs> I'm talking about. Business. That's, yeah, that's so. what I'm talking yeah. about, man, in the Midwest. Y'all, please um, look their links up. Please hit them up if y'all need anything, uh, merchandise, or if y'all need uh, music, please look them up. Uh, like and subscribe this page and this channel. Yeah. Um, we we just here to support other uh, Midwest uh, black and brown business. Uh, please hit the like and subscribe button. If you don't hit the like and subscribe button, it is said that you don't like black people. Now I didn't say that. <laughs> I didn't say that. I, you know that's just what's being said in the streets. So don't be <laughs> the one that don't support black and brown people. You, know, you really don't. Once again, I appreciate y'all, man. It's good having y'all again. Y'all take it easy. Appreciate it. I'm motivated, I'm coming up. I'm motivated, I'm coming up. I'm motivated, I'm coming up. Get motivated to come on up. I'm motivated, I'm coming up. I'm motivated, I'm coming up. I'm motivated, I'm coming up. Get motivated and come on up.